<laughs> Why? Because uh, I thought that the existing traps weren't very nice and I would like one to do simulated game shooting on the farm for me. Right. And uh, so I realised that existing traps didn't go far enough or fast enough. So I tried to make something that did. And this is the result. Okay. And it's, it's been a bit of a journey getting here, but yeah. You're happy with the way it's working at the moment? Yes, yes. Yeah. certainly yeah. now. It, uh, when I say uh, it's been difficult, it's been frustrating. Yes. But it's not been that long. Uh, it wouldn't be two years from right. conception to this, really. Which I, right. I think is, is okay. really quite reasonable. So what's, what's the principle it works on? I mean, it looks, it looks quite extraordinary. It's not a bit like a, uh, a regular uh, clay pigeon trap, is it? Uh, it is uh, a, 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 an arm that is rotating all the time on the motor, which you can probably see underneath. Oh, okay, there's a motor underneath. And that's run from the, the car battery on the floor? Yes, that's run from the car battery on the floor. And then if you come back here, you can see that the arm... That the arm mind everybody a minute. If you, I'm just going to start it up. And uh, as, as, we, as we start it, you can see that the arm starts to turn. Oh, I can see that starting to turn in there, yeah. All you need to do is to drop the clay in the middle of that hole and it'll fly in that direction. I see. So the, is there a counterbalance so that it doesn't kind of vibrate too much? Uh, Must yes, be. The, the it's all hidden inside this dustbin lid. Right. I'm not sure right. who I'm talking to whether I'll take the cover off. Oh, right. okay. Well, it's, uh, I'm with one of the shooting magazines, so if you if you want to keep it secret, no, don't, don't tell no, me. No, no, I don't particularly want to keep it secret. <laughs> I, I won't give you a graphic detail. No, no, inside. okay. But, uh, Cover. It needs the arm straight for the cover to come off. All right. And uh, this is a counterbalance weight. And I see. Similar to a conventional uh, clay arm. It does look very similar. It's got the rubber strip and everything, Absolutely. hasn't it? It yeah. has a top cover, which uh, is quite important. Right. Uh, and also a, a mechanism here which is uh, which allows the clay to be released <laughs> at the correct time. Oh, that's a sort of a timing thing, is it? Yes. So that it's exactly. letting the that, clay that, go. That engages, engages here to allow the clay to go. When there's a clay in there, it engages there, I which see. allows the clay to go. Otherwise it would let the clay go at any Absolutely. wrong moment. So yeah, it okay. allows it to go at the correct time. So you drop the clay in, but it's only yes. released when it exactly reaches so. the right point. Right, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, it all looks... Um, it all looks relatively um, straightforward. I mean, you can see... It is see very simple. There's, there's very little to the it. The principle behind it the is, principle is, is simple, very simple. Getting Making there it was, work uh, was, uh, <laughs> was something else, yeah. Something else. Yeah. Okay, and the um, the tripod allows you to, because you're not having to release an arm, I suppose you can you can happily move it around direct how you want. Any way you want. Yeah. Exactly so. You can direct. As I will show. Oh, we've got some plays now. Would you like to see some plays go? Oh yeah. Well, if you come behind me. I will. I don't want to get shot. There. And this this you put some plays on the, this in the blue magazine. piece is just a magazine. That's it. Okay. Which will stand back. Mind the cars. <laughs> That's going a hell of a distance. Well, I, I don't think there are many clay traps that will throw clays as far as this will. Have you measured it? Do you know how far? Well, it's uh, very difficult when you say how far does the clay go, because there's all things that vary, like wind, height, direction. Um, from a height with the trailing wind, it'll do over 200 yards. That's a lot better than most. Well, on a flat ground with no wind, uh, it'll probably do 120 to 130. Right, right. But even that's pretty impressive. So you can throw some good, uh, good simulated game type targets with that, yeah? Yes, you will. Oh, we've seen a few today, haven't we? Go on, I got you. <laughs> yes, because of course we can do That's hard. <laughs> Fantastic. She's hitting the outside, this one. He's <laughs> just glad you didn't hit one of his customers' cars, isn't he? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Terrifying. 
<laughs> so that's brilliant. Can brilliant. <laughs> so where are we now? You've you've got it. Um, I mean, this is a prototype, and it's yes, being it's, used. Uh, well, I've I've got a, here at enough, enough to build uh, enough parts to build 25 like this. Right. Uh, I uh, the plastic cover I think is good enough to uh, at least test the market with. But I think a, 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 a more substantial cover right. is still right is necessary, and some of the wearing parts need to be better. Yeah. But yeah. uh, apart from that, uh, then it should be bulletproof. It is such a simple design that. But one of the disadvantages, obviously, if a clay is broken in half, yeah, then it is likely to be stuck in the top. Right. Um, in which case, you have to stop the machine, take the top off, take the clay out. I see. So uh, it, that happens much less with midi clays and big. Oh right. Yeah. But as anybody that knows with clay pigeons, you find half clays in a box, a half clay in that stack most likely will stay in the top and oh, okay. need to be removed. Yeah, yeah. So it happens not so very often, yeah. but perhaps once in 50 clays or something mm, like that, mm. which makes it difficult to make this sort of thing automatic. Yes, yes, I can see that. And yeah. also the weight. Yeah. I have made an automatic machine, but when it becomes... The, the advantages of this is it's so light and convenient and simple to use. It is very straightforward, isn't it? Mm. Yes. Mm. And I, I, was, I was amazed to hear that there were only two traps throwing all those clays at us this morning. <laughs> we were quite uh, quite overwhelmed with all the clays, and yet, uh, yet it was all coming out of one or two traps. Yes, you can definitely entertain nine guns with two traps if you've got sufficient height. Yeah, but three yeah. are better because yes. you then have got a crossing. The the, the, the the guns don't know which direction the clay is yes. coming from, yeah. which but makes a much makes better it more fun. Yeah, performance. Yeah. You want to stress that, don't you, that you're not launching it yet? Yes, this is, this, is not not, this is not a launching. This is just uh, because Hugh has been using them all season, and it's uh, Hugh's day today, yes. and uh, he felt it would be nice if I could come along and explain where we are. But, Excellent, uh, yeah, uh, that's, that's good. As I say, I hope, uh, perhaps towards the beginning of next year, we may have uh, 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 a, a different aspect uh, and, and confidence and the uh, machine hopefully marketed properly mm. but at the moment it's just uh, just really in a trial state and yeah. I, have ha I have it at the two shooting schools uh, both of which have been very pleased with it but uh, it still needs to be more reliable and better mm -hmm. made than it is before we sell any number. Sure. What I'm trying to do is to interest local people so that, right. that I can keep on in, in, in touch with them mm -hmm. and keep them managed properly. Right. And have you you've you've protected the the design with patents? Have Hopefully, you? yes. Yeah, yes. we have a, a what's called. Otherwise, a, people a, are going to watch this and nick your idea. Well, uh, good luck to them. <laughs> it's, uh, there's a lot more to it than meets the eye. Uh, right. uh, not in su simplicity, but in what breaks the clays and what doesn't. And it's right. been really difficult. Um, but uh, yes, I, hopefully I have it protected with an international patent application, a PCT application, which I have the number if, you, if you're interested. <laughs> no, I'll, I'll, give I'll you, believe you. I'll give you the detail. <laughs> yeah. um, and uh, one hopes that that may yeah. be successful. Um, yeah. But the, it, it's not a straightforward thing to copy. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> and good luck to anybody. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's excellent. Well, exactly wish you the best of luck. It's been terrific shooting it. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, fantastic. Thank you.